Shalom, shalom. Giving honor and praise to the creator and maker of heaven and earth. My name is Yeshaya Yisrael, the tribe of Don of the nation of Israel. This is not going to be a long speech or so forth and so on. But just wanted to address a matter shortly. And it is this. Regarding Old Testament based brothers and sisters and New Testament based brothers and sisters or Old Testament based brothers and sisters and Bible based brothers and sisters. There's a question that was asked and it's this. If the Torah which is from Genesis to Deuteronomy if that is the base of all Israelites, if Israelites always go to Deuteronomy, the 28th chapter, which is in the Torah, if Israelites read, for instance, outside of the Torah, in the book of Joshua, when it says about keeping the law of Moses, when you go in the last book of the standard Bible, in the book of Malachi, the last book of the Old Testament in the standard Bible, and it reads about, remember ye, the law of Moses, my servant. Point is, the entire Old Testament is pointing you back to the Torah. So now, for the brothers and sisters who also subscribe to the New Testament, and they will cite Revelation 22, that says, they who reject the law or who don't keep the commandments, or like dogs. When it says in Mark the 10th chapter about keeping the commandments. As well as in Mark the 12th chapter about keeping the commandments. As well as in 1 John chapter 5 about keeping the commandments. All of those being cited within the New Testament. If we know that the parts in the Old Testament are citing you back to the Torah. And there are parts in the New Testament that is citing you back to the Torah. Why then do you have the contention, the arguing, the disrespect even, between said Old Testament-based brothers and sisters and Bible-based brothers and sisters when you cannot prove outside of using the Torah that you are the people of the Torah? When Joshua, the son of Nun, the successor to Moses, the only book he had was the Torah. So those are just certain things to be noted for reason and purposes. Shalom. Most I bless.